Developing a vaccine for HIV has been far harder than anyone imagined when the virus was first discovered to cause AIDS in 1981. But now an entirely new line of research into the cells that orchestrate the body's immune response, called dendritic cells, is ready to be tested in people. And researchers hope that the fresh approach will succeed where three decades of vaccine trials have not. So this, this human clinical trial is the culmination of 15 years of laboratory science in immunology and vaccine development. So we're very excited to be beginning the first humans trial of a vaccine to prevent HIV that directly targets dendritic cells. Dendritic cells are antigen presenting cells. They're the cell in the body that conducts the immune system. They teach the other cells how to fight infections and also cancer. The researchers are able to target dendritic cells because of a distinctive marker on the cell surface, a receptor called DEC205. They have engineered a powerful antibody to seek out the receptor and deliver a small piece of an HIV protein. Dendritic cells then tell the immune system to seek and destroy anything can protein, in other words, HIV, wherever it is found in the body. So what we've done is we've taken a monoclonal antibody, which is an antibody that's very pure, that knows how to find the DEC205 in a person, and we fuse to it a little protein synthesized from HIV. So the monoclonal antibody carries the antigen directly to the dendritic cell, which then picks it up, processes it, and shows it to the other cells that need to see it to make immunity. So the researchers at Rockefeller are pushing forward with their new approach planning to test whether the vaccine is safe and, by testing volunteers' blood samples, the kind of immune response it generates. They hope eventually it will lead to a licensed vaccine that will prevent infection by HIV. So developing a vaccine is an iterative process. You have to take a step forward and then learn from that step and then take the next step forward. So what we're hoping to learn from this process is the kind of immunity that this vaccine elicits and how to make it better. We strongly believe, based on our laboratory experiments and our preclinical data, that by directly targeting the dendritic cell, we're not only going to increase the level of immunity, but perhaps more importantly, the quality of the immune response is going to be more effective in combating the virus.